So welcome to my another video on my Simi channel. And as usual, right now I will tell you guys how to install Timo Loader all-in-one pack for non-Steam user. Anyway, I'm not sure this version will always compatible and suitable with all of you guys because this all-in-one pack it's a simple setup. Of course, it's have negative side, but don't worry. If you fail, I already create how to install Terraria and Timo Loader manually, but it's more complex and difficult if you follow carefully it will work a hundred percent trust me but before that i just want to tell you guys next week i'm going to university and i didn't expect that i would have this many subscribers more than three thousands this a uh, big number for me and i will say thank you very much for all of you guys for spend your time to watch my video and also if you guys subscribe like to support my channel thank you very much I just want to tell you guys for this because I don't think I will have a lot of free time to make another video like this. So if you guys asking me, please update a video, please upload another video. So sorry guys, I will try to find a free time to spend to make another video. But right now I'm really busy. I need to join with a lot of competition. So that's all guys. That's all things I can to say. The first thing you need to do are make sure your device is connected to internet. This is important when you are first time installed Timot Loader and also want to download some mods. Next, you must to have Steam because to download mods in Timot Loader, you must to have Steam and account Steam too. After that, you must to make sure your system have Microsoft Visual C++ 2015 and distribute update 3. But honestly, in default, this program is already there, but some people in my Discord tell me they don't have this program, so they need to install manually again. Please install this because to run Timot Loader, you must to have this program. The next is just optional. If you receive some problem, maybe this thing can help you. So the first thing is make sure you install Terraria and Timot Loader in the other partition system. So if you only have partition system, I would recommend that you to create the new one partition. I would not recommend that you install Terraria and Timor Loader in system because maybe they have security doesn't allow you to run Timor Loader. So that's why you get stuck or the game is not running or the loading screen is so slow. The next thing is you must to go to document and then you will find folder called as May Games and you must to remove folder called as terraria maybe because you are using other terraria version and when you are using this terraria version they can be collision and make the game broken or crash in the next step you must to have this file it's called as terraria with timot loader all in one pack and you must to extract this compressed file using winrar for example and just extract here like this After extraction finish, open the folder and you can see there are three folder, but normally it's only two. It was Terraria and Timot Loader. But I create another one called as bind or binaries. And if you open the folder, you can see there are four file.bat. This file, it's for you guys because maybe if you are the first time using a Timot Loader, you will confuse to find which one file for run Timo Loader. So I hope you, you can just run from bind folder and you can choose. Do you want to run Terraria or Timo Loader? Or maybe you just want to run server Timo Loader or Terraria. So you don't need to open Terraria or Timo Loader folder again. You can just run from here and it will automatic run Terraria or Timo Loader. This is for example, I will run timotloader.bat. After that, you will see there are a command prompt appears and tell you you need to wait for 5 minutes for installation. If your PC performance are slow, maybe it's gonna take a more. Just because my installation fast, does not mean you will fast too, okay? If the installation in command prompt finished, they will show you the screen like this. If the screen stuck and nothing happened, probably your PC is slow. Or maybe your system doesn't allow to run Timot Loader. How to fix that? Simple, just install Terraria and Timot Loader in other partitions except the system. And also make sure 
your antivirus doesn't block Terraria or Timotoder. As you can see, the Timotoder now has been run, and uh, the sun is appear and the screen are moving. And you can see here, you must to choose language you want to use. For me, it's English. And then we are going to fix our resolution. You just need to go to settings and then video and then resolution and make sure the resolution are same with your screen and also don't forget to click go full screen after that just apply the settings next to download mods you wanted you just need to go to workshop and then go to download mods and there we are you can see there are a list of the mods you want to download if you didn't find any mods you wanted to download, for example, like Halamity, Torium, even you search, they doesn't appear. Make sure in upper left, there are icon. You can see there are text sort by popularity. Click it and you will find Calamity mod to be the number one. To download mods you wanted, you just need to click button with uh, text download with dependencies. And after that, the progress will show like this. First time. You will see the progress 0 per 0. It's normal. There's a lot of people asking me, what? 0 per 0. It's normal. It's just a bug from a Steam file to send information progress to Timot Other. In the background, the download is still run. And what you need to do are just wait until the download finishes. How to know the download finish? The progress will back to the mod browser. And if you go to the manage mods, you, you will see the mods you wanted to download, it's already there. So that's all step to install the mod loader all in one pack newest version. I hope it's gonna work in your device. And if you fail, you can comment to my video sections or join my discord server and tell me what's your problem i will help you as i can also don't forget to subscribe and like this video and don't forget to to share to your friends to your family or others in the next time probably i will make a video about how to play multiplayer using this team of other version and also how to update team of other to newest version i think that's it see you in the next video bye bye guys